Hey there, YouTube. Whiskey Cactus here, welcoming you back to our Pokemon Sword Let's Play. This is episode number 16, and last time we uh, got to the point where we are ready, I think, I think we're ready to take on Hammerlock Jim. So let's do a very quick, very quick team rundown. We have uh, Quoth, our Corviknight, with Dropex St Steelwing Revenge and U-Turn. We have um, Aurora, the Frozmoth, and let me go ahead and switch these around. Um, we got her Ice Beam last time. We got Ice Beam, we got Struggle Bug, Icy Wind, and U-Turn. We have uh, Snapdragon, our uh, Flapple with Grav Apple, Dragon Pulse, U-Turn, and Acrobatics. We have Crisis, the Colossal with Rock Slide, Heat Crash, Ancient Power, and Dig. And we have uh, Hilda, the Hatterene, with Psychic, Dazzling Gleam, Gleam Brutal Swing, and Magical Leaf. And finally, Xanax, our Inteleon, our starter, with uh, Snipe Shot, U-Turn, Sucker Punch, and Icy Wind. So, I think we're in a pretty good spot with coverage moves. I think we're okay. It's a tough call. <laughs> I'm just not totally sure. I think I want to switch Xanax into first slot. Mostly to get the, uh, to get the, the money. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So, I think we're ready to head into the gym. And, uh, huh. let's hope. Let's hope, guys. Let's hope. I'm afraid. It's dragons. So, I don't know, man. I think it's going to be a little tricky. Do we have our, do we have, we do. She's up there. She's up there. We have our fan. Hello. All that's left is the final gym. You can do it, Challenger Whiskey. Thank you for being there for me. You've been here in, I think, every gym except one. For some reason, well, not counting Spike Myth. Uh, but you weren't in uh, Kabu's gym for whatever reason. I don't know why, but uh, maybe you you were away evolving your Pokemon. I don't know. Hello, do I talk to you to register? That's the uniform shop. I'm not. I'm not in the market for a new uniform. I think I'm pretty good. These look decent. I do I do like the flyingly, but no, I'm I'm going with my. Oops. With my goth, not goth, but like. Street punk. <laughs> Look. Hello. Uh, you're the Pokemon. Who do I talk to to get this? Oh, this guy up here. Dumbass. Dumbass. Hello. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Crash bang. <laughs> the long gym challenge is nearing its end, I see. You ready to face Hammerlock Gym and its leader, the dragon user Raihan? I guess. <laughs> Alright. I feel like this is gonna be real hard. I don't know, man. I feel like this is gonna be real hard. We'll see. I just remember Claire. That's that's all that's all it is. I just remember Claire. And I know she was a bitch and also a difficult trainer. Uh uh-huh. The, the vault. Okay. Going to the vault. Well. That's fine, I guess. Okay. Loading screens. Here we are. Hello there, Raihan. Let's see, how many gym challenges are left? Huh? Not even ten, eh? Alright then. Whiskey, time to explain the great Raihan's gym mission. The rules are simple. All you've got to do is defeat th three gym trainers that I personally trained in double battles. Oh, hey, that's interesting. The gym challenge is meant to be, well, challenging, wouldn't you say? Naturally, there aren't too many gym challenges who can make it this far. And that's why I provide a format where you can really show off the brilliant combinations you and your Pokémon should be capable of. That's probably more than enough out of me. Time for someone else to take the spotlight. Come on, Sebastian, you'll be first. Okay. Well, double battles. Not sure who I'm leading with. I think it's... Well, I know Inteleon, but uh, who is second? Frozmoth? That's actually not bad. Yeah, that's me, Sebastian. Leader Raihan has taught me two things. First, that dragon types are ferociously powerful. Second, that I need to create an advantage on the battlefield to fully utilize that power. Well, alright. Hip hip cheerio. Sebastian, Pelipper and Sligo. Oh, he's going rain team. Pelipper's not a dragon. That's some bullshit. Well, alright, he's gonna set up the rain, he's got the drizzle. That's fine. 
Now, I'm gonna guess that's not a Modest Pelipper with Focus Sash. <laughs> we can Icy Wind. Maybe. What do I want to do with that Pelipper? I think I want to U-turn. I think I want to U-turn. What do I have for the Pelipper, though? That's the real question. My Rocks is also a Rock Fire, and I don't want to put that up with the Rain Up. Um, I don't have Electricity, so that's that's kind of a, a problem. You know what? You know what I could do? He's not going to be doing Swift Swim shenanigans, so I'm just going to Icy Wind. And then I'll have uh, Frozmoth Ice Beam the Sligoo. That should be good. Well, Icy Wind, get their speed down, do some damage on the Sligoo. And then I think we should be able to pick up the knockout with the Icy Wind. How does that sound? I think that sounds pretty good. Here we go. Boom, that Ice Beam is going to come in clutch, I can tell. We picked that up um, as a TR. We bought it from one of the guys in the wild area. Right at the end of the last episode. And not always oh, setting up the tailwind. Oh god. This is so uh, that that's a fucking VGC Pelipper. Oh, that's all he has. Okay. <laughs> so he's gonna be faster than me, but he can't actually Aurora probably doesn't want to stay in on this. So I'm gonna snipe shot. Um, because it's rain boosted. And I'm gonna actually go ahead. He's gonna be faster than me, so I'm gonna do a hard switch. He's probably gonna hurricane. Who wants to take a hurricane? Quoth can take a hurricane. Quoth can take a hurricane. Let's see if we made that read correctly. I'm still faster. How am I still faster than this guy under Tailwind? He's got the Tailwind up. That's ridiculous. Oh, he goes for Air Slash. Not for Hurricane. Maybe it's not a VGC developer. <laughs> All right, well, we know we outspeed. I don't know how we outspeed, but we do. I'll go ahead and drill pack. All right. That could have been a lot more difficult. That was a crit. Because that totally mattered. That totally mattered. All right, this gym scares me a lot less than it did a few minutes ago. All right, Sebastian, go home. Doubles? There's a lot to think about with them. It makes them difficult, but fun, too. Uh, very much so. I am very much a fan of doubles. That is, that is my preferred format for uh, Battle Spot. I can see why you've man managed to make it this far. Time to, fi time to face the second trainer. Come on, Camilla. Alright, so we're going with the same lead, I guess. Oh. No, we're not. Okay. So we can heal up. Good. Okay. We can heal up and we can change our leads if we want to. Um, do we want to? Um, I don't think so. I think our leads are pretty good. Let's stick with that. They both have U-turn if we need to. So I'm good. Let's see that. What we gonna do? Gym Trainer Camilla. Nine tails and oh, that she's setting up the sun. Oh boy. Yeah, we don't want to be in on any of this. <laughs> I mean, I don't really think they can touch. Oh, never. No, no, no. Nine tails get solar beam. Nine tails get solar beam. Forget that. Scratch that immediately. All right, Xanax, you are going to U-turn into. I feel like we need to double into the Turtonator. It's not like they're gonna protect. Um, so yeah, let's U-turn. Double U-turn into the Turtonator. Just get as much damage off on this thing as possible. I'm gonna do a double switch. I want, uh, definitely want Crisis out here. Because Crisis can use rocks. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I didn't account for the Nine Tails being faster. <laughs> that was a bad play. Should have just hard swapped. Alright, that, that will eat that up. That's fine. Okay. Who are we sending in? Um, oh, I don't even know who wants to be in here on this. I guess it's Hilda. Must be Hilda. It's nobody else. Quoth takes super effective from fire. Snapdragon takes neutral from fire. Snapdragon can potential stuff here. You know what? I'm gonna send in Snapdragon. Maybe to my detriment. 
But we are going to go ahead. That Nine Tails is going to be really fast. We're going to Rock Slide. And I'm going to Dragon Pulse the Turtonator. Oh boy. What is that? Oh, a Shell Trap. Shit. Extra Sensory? Okay. That's fine. Nice. Get out of here, Turtonator. Sorry, Aurora, you don't get that uh, EXP. And Rock Slide is now a single target move and should obliterate that Ninetales. Oh, what? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Alright, I'm gonna not risk the miss. And uh, we'll just go ahead and Acrobatics. Disable? That's fine. I use different moves on everybody. It's totally fine. That's totally fine. There we go. Drop that nine tails. Level up for Xanax. And Camilla goes down. Alright, so I'm going to guess, because we saw a rain team and a sun team, I'm going to guess you, whoever you are, Aria, are going to have either sand or hail. And I'm going to go big brain. I'm going to go big brain, and I could be wrong, but I'm going to go big brain. Because we know that Raihan has uh, the steel dragon dude. I'm going to guess, I don't know if Raihan's going to do weather also. But I think if he does, he's most likely to have sand. Because the steel dragon would play well in that. So I'm going to guess that we're going to have a hail team. I don't know if there's an ice dragon other than Kyurem, which is, is not in this game. So I'm going to lead, I'm going to lead you, Crisis. And Xanax? I don't want to lead Aurora. If it's going to be a hail team, I don't want Aurora being out there. She can't really do anything to ice types. What would it be if it's a hail team? Who sets up snow? A bomb of snow. What dragon... I don't know. Let's send in. Let's let's have Hilda. Let's use Hilda, because she can use fairy type stuff, and that's that should be fine. Even if it ends up being sand, Hilda should be fine. So let's do that. Oh, definitely support. Definitely support each other. Definitely support each other. Obama Snow and Hakamoto. Good play. Good play. Could also have been the, um, the, uh, what is it? Ice cream. <laughs> the ice cream dude. <laughs> Alright, somebody's got coverage moves from me. Uh, we're gonna heat crash the Obama Snow. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk the biscuit here, and I'm gonna dazzling gleam. Brick break? I'm not afraid of that. Not afraid of that. Aurora Veil. I'm afraid of that a little bit. I didn't know you got Aurora Veil. That's pretty crazy. Well, I guess Alola Ninetales isn't here. So. Makes sense. You're gonna live this for sure. Yeah. But, the Dazzling Gleam should finish you off. Uh, wow, okay. <laughs> Guys, hail teams aren't really that good. Let's be real. There we go. Hilda leveling up. Snapdragon leveling up. Fantastic. Nicely done. Alright, so. That means he's probably going to be sand. Completed the gym mission. Time to head to the gym stadium. Oh boy. I guess we're leading the, the lead we have. Oh no, we can switch it up. Okay. 
Okay. Um, we'll use a super potion on you, and I think we should be good. So, I don't know if he's going to run sand or not. I don't know if he's going to run sand or not. But, I feel like water. Xanax is probably a good lead. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Xanax is probably a good lead. No. Fuck. Fuck. Xanax. Lead. Um, do we want Hilda out front? Because Dazzling Gleam is good. Dazzling Gleam's not going to be good against the Steel Dragon, though. Crisis is able to handle that. You know what? I think I'm, I think I'm going to go Xanax Aurora again. You know what? This might not even be a double battle. I don't even know. <laughs> so, hold on. Let's not make assumptions. I, Xanax is a good lead. I'll keep Aurora there in case we have a double battle. But if not, then we have uh, Xanax leading. Let's see. Finally, a challenger made it. I've been waiting for someone to battle. Though I've got to admit, I didn't think it'd be you. But I guess I should have expected no less from a Pokemon trainer that Leon saw promise in. You guys have such a bromance, oh my god. And if you aim to defeat Leon, do you have any idea just how high a hurdle that is? As his greatest rival, I, I guess that I, Raihan, will have to show you. Gym Leader Raihan doesn't say- Stop referring to yourself in the third person. Doesn't simply control the weather. He seeks to- So he is weather and double battle. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. I think we'll be okay with that. My guess is sand. Again, because of the steel dragon and because we haven't seen it yet. This fucking music. Oh, giggle with and fly on. I'm happy with our lead. <laughs> okay. I am very happy with our lead. Now, I'm assuming we're not doing any after you or, like, any of those kind of shenanigans. Any competitive VGC shenanigans. So, if I feel like snipe shotting the Gigalith and ice beaming the Flygon should get the job done here. We know it has Sandstream and not Sturdy, so we're good. That should Oko. Does. It's a crit, that's fine. Gigalith goes down. So he must have four mons then. Aurora levels up, Crisis levels up. Flygon uses Thunder Punch. Okay, that's fine. You can you can hit Xanax, that's fine. That was a crit. This ice beam is easily gonna drop this flygon. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. That first turn couldn't have gone any better. Alright. Xanax is kind of out of commission now, though. I don't know if Aurora is going to still be useful. We got Duraludon. So that's that's the Steel Dragon. Who else has he got? Sandaconda. Okay. That's not... Is that a dragon? I don't know if that's ground dragon or not. Um, hmm. I think we hard switch. No, I don't think we hard switch. I think we can U-turn. I think we U-turn, and I want to... Either way, it's resisted, right? Oh, no, no, it's, it's not resisted on the Santa Cana. We'll hit that then. I feel like... Aurora might drop because of the steel move. But if I can Ice Beam the Sandaconda and take it out, if I'm able to get away with smacking up the Sandaconda, that'd be great. I can't see Duraludon being fast. Maybe I'm wrong, but I can't see it being fast. Holy shit, it's a skyscraper. It's just a building. I go to work in that building. It's a level 48. Okay, well, we're going to U-turn out of here. And we will do the safe switch. That did quite a bit. I'm happy with that damage output. I'm going to switch into Crisis. This Crisis is going to be really important here. And can we get the Ice Beam off? Are we fast enough? No, Max Rockfall. Oh, my bug's dead. Yeah, shit. He knew. He knew to go for Aurora. 
He knew to go for Aurora. All right, what do we have for Sandaconda? Oh, he goes Earth Power. What? How did he read that? There's no way he could read that. Oh, fuck you. All right. Um, that was a, that was a terrible turn. All right, so Snapdragon's gonna have to be our answer to Sandaconda. This got really bad. All right. <laughs> So I think we're going to Dynamax Crisis and we're going to Max Quake the Duraludon. And then Snapdragon is going to grab Apple the Sandigna. I think that's the play here. I'm just hoping we can outspeed. We need to outspeed the Sandaconda is what we need to do. We need to be able to outspeed the Sandaconda. All right. Ugh, what the fuck is G-Max Depletion? It's gotta be a dragon move. Oh, man. Okay, we live it. We live it. That's so important. We get this grab apple off. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, Sandaconda goes down. Snapdragon can drop. That's fine. We can let Snapdragon drop. Now the important thing is we get this Max Quake off. So we do not outspeed the Duraludon. Oh, it eats it up. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Snapdragon goes down to the Sandstorm. All right. What is our answer now? I think Quath can come in and tank for a moment. Like, I'm kind of sending Quath out here to be a decoy. Alright, so we're going to max Quake. I'm afraid he's going to hit Crisis now. Because he's got his only, his only Mon. Uh, but I do want to revive... I think I want to revive Snapdragon. Do I want to revive Snapdragon? Snapdragon. Or do I want to just heal up Xanax? I think I actually, I think I want to heal up Xanax instead. We have 10 max potions. Let's use the max potion on Xanax. That's the answer. That's the play. That's the play. He's going to use a fighting type move. Oh, man. That's going to kill him. No, it's not. Okay. I don't know what kind of... Oh, he hit... Yeah, no, he hit me. He hit Crisis. That seemed like a big waste. Not sure why he did that. I guess that's the best super effective move he had. Does Crisis really wall this thing? Maybe it does. All right, let's go for Max Quake. And you know what? Here's what we're gonna do. On Quath's turn, we're gonna heal up Crisis. I'll just use a Super Potion. There we go. That should that should do it. That should absolutely do it. It's got Stone Edge. Now <laughs> he he misses. Now we take him out. Ooh. Okay. Nicely done. Nicely done. That ended up not being much of a problem. There we go, man. That is our eighth badge. That is our eighth badge. I might have lost, but I still look good. Maybe I should snap a quick selfie. Just got a bunch of money. Give me my final badge, my dude. In the aftermath of the furious battle, I feel as pure and refreshed as when the sky clears after a storm. What can I possibly say? Calling myself Leon's rival, seems like I'd grown quite conceited for someone who can't even claim the title of champion. Overconfident in both myself and my team. I'll give you what you want, then. The proof of your victory. The Dragon Badge. 
Well, there we have it. Well, there we have it, the final badge. And look at that, guys. It is completed. You can now catch Pokemon of any level. You've collected all the gym badges from the Gala region. Now win your way through the semifinals and finals for your chance to challenge Leon. You must. You owe us that much at least for beating us in ba beating us in battle here today. Well, there we go. What TM do we get? Dragon Claw. That's TR, I think. Hey, whiskey. Sorry to hold you up, but there was something I forgot. TM9 Breaking Swipe, what is that? What in the world? Huh! Interesting. Dragon type gym uniform. Alright. Completed the gym challenge. Good on you, kid. Now the previous strength, the whole region of the Champion Cup. <clears throat> Pokemon, Raihan! I'm here to see just how good you are. There you are, Leon's little brother. Don't worry, I'll give you a battle that'll make you want to quit the gym challenge altogether. I've tried out lots of different strategies, and I've made up my mind about how I want to battle. I'm not going to lose. I'm gonna beat you, and Whiskey, and even Lee. I'll be seeing you, Whiskey. Let's have another epic battle someday. If you're feeling up to it, you may want to go train hard at the wild area. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, but first, first Pokemon Center. Nope, not first Pokemon Center. Well, I still wanna, I still wanna go because I want to um, stock up on items. Oh boy! Oh, it's Sonia. Hey there, Whiskey. You gave Rahan a good thrashing, and that means you have completed the gym challenge. Congratulations from the bottom of my heart. I really wish we could go celebrate. But I think there's some things we should talk over. That light that covered Hammerlock. It was just like the darkest day, where it's said that giant Pokemon went on a rampage and almost destroyed the entire, ga entire Gala region. It certainly seems to be that way, my dear. As you know, we Dynamax our Pokemon today using the energy from wishing stars that have fallen to us. But we still don't know how to fully control the energy behind Dynamaxing or how the two heroes managed to do so. In fact, we're not even really sure who, or what, the two heroes actually were. The legendary Sword and Shield. Sonya, my dearest, my lab coat is yours now. What? Are you sure, Gran? I still haven't finished the work you've assigned me. Think of this as something to help you finish that work. Get the fuck out of here! Sonia becomes the professor. Oh my god, that's amazing. That is amazing. Professor Sonia. Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. She's she's it. She's it. She's it. That's it. That that's that settles it. It's Sonia. Sonia's the one. Number one. Sorry, Nessa. Sorry, sorry, Marnie. It's 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 Sonia. <laughs> it's definitely Sonia. The two heroes that protected the Gallo region from the darkest day. And the legend of the sword and shield you just mentioned. It's up to you to figure out the truth behind it all. I know, Gran. I'll do what I can. You and Hop could be the one to take down Leon, and I don't want to miss that. Not to worry, you can count on me to take care of everything. You just focus on getting to Winden. Go on, head to the station or you'll miss your train. Oh my god, I love it! I love it. I love it. I stand Sonia so fucking hard. God damn. Professor Sonia. That's a first, too. I don't think we've ever seen... The, the professor's never changed from the start of the game to the, fin to the end of the game. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. Man, Sonia's the best character. Alright, what do you sell? Um, nah. Nah. I need to, uh... You sell Master Balls now, right? I just I need to stock up on everything. So we got that. We got... I want to get a few more of these. Let's get, like, six. That's good. We got so much money. 
You can buy full restores now. You know what? We're gonna need some of those too. Give me 20 of those. It's expensive, but it'll be worth having those. Um, and the revives, we're good there. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. So we're going to, um, the Pokemon League, I guess. Shit. That's a big deal. Everybody's cheering for me. Yahoo! Yahoo! Here we go, man. I'm feeling on top of the world. Let me guess. We're gonna have to battle hop again, aren't we? Maybe. Maybe not. Guess not. Oh. Shit. <laughs> Pokemon! Wait up, Whiskey! I'm coming too! I had Rahan beat in no time! Once I got my head on straight and stopped doubting every decision I made, that is, heh. <laughs> Look at that character development. Just don't make me battle you. And you never stop nattering on <laughs> through the entire battle. Ha ha ha. So Raihan noticed it too, huh? You're pretty different from the, the, from the champion in that. But your strength is genuine, as proven by the dragon badge you won from me. You came at me with the f all the force of a raging storm, and even I was blown away. Listen up, you two. Battle your way through the Champion Cup tournament to face Leon. One of you ought to. I reckon I'm still the favorite to win. I don't think so. <laughs> but I'm up against my true rival, Whiskey. So I'll ring out every last thing I learned during my battle with you, Raihan, to beat him. So get a move on, Whiskey. The train's waiting. Let's fucking do it. Let's fucking do it. Here we go, guys. We're on the train, just like at the beginning. Just like at the beginning. On our phones. We're finally headed for Winden. There's a lot I want to check out there. It's that big tower and the monorail. And Winden Stadium, where the whole of Galar know the world is going to be watching us. Nah, I'm pretty sure it's just Galar. You get it, right? You and me are going to make our, ma our match there the greatest match that ever was. Okay. Hello, dude. Snow over. What you got? Huh. Alright. Oh, we're not at Winden. This is Route 10. It's like a wall made out of snow. Bet there'll be ice-type Pokemon crawling out of the woodwork in a place like this. Come on, Whiskey. Reckon we'll be able to train ourselves up to new heights here. Before the Champion Cup starts, I believe in myself and the Pokemon on my team, and I know we'll all get loads stronger. So I'm off. See you in Winden, mate. Well, all right. I guess we will. Two X attacks. All right. I guess we'll uh, do some things and some stuff and some. There's a Cubchu. Hello, Cubchu. We got a Max revive. That's pretty good. And we got somebody to fight. Let's fight. Let's you and me fight. We got time to fight. Hello there, Dr. Graham. Got a Gardevoir. And I've got a Xanax. It's hailing. And that Gardevoir is a level 45. We can beat that thing up. Let's do a U-turn. Boom. 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 Hello there. Pretty sure you don't want to have anything to do with this monstrosity. Yeah, you go for that. You go for that. See what happens. See what happens when I smack you with a steel wing. Alright. Taking damage. Let's go steel wing. It missed. Of course it missed. Of course it missed! Why wouldn't it miss? <sighs> Alright, we'll try that again! What the fuck, guys? What the fuck? Boom! There we go. <laughs> Get out of here, Gardevoir. Kill the levels up, Snapdragon levels up. Everybody leveling up out here. 
Pokemon ended up injured. Alright. Continuing upward. What is this? This is like a... This is kind of a scary place. What do we got here? Mountain climbing. We got a hiker. Let's take on this hiker. Douglas, what do you got? A Steelix. A whole ass Steelix. I'm betting I can snipe shot you and Oko. That is a whole ass Steelix. Alright, let's see how you like this snipe shot. You do not like that snipe shot. You don't ha even have sturdy. Okay. Welp. Welp. We got Mudsdale coming out. We'll just snipe shot you also. There we go. Making progress. Xanax and Crisis. Fantastic. Alright. 9,000 bucks. I will take. Especially after I just dropped 60 grand on uh, full restores. We got. Oh my god, what are you? Hold the fucking phone. That's a Mr. Mime. Guys. We have Galarian Ice Type Mr. Mime. He's level 46. Alright, I'm gonna. I don't know what to do with you. If you're Ice Type. Alright, U turn is probably safe. Oh, that does a lot. Oh, you must still be Psychic. Ice Psychic. Okay, what what will wall that? Crisis will. Crisis will wall that. Guess I'll throw a ball. Freeze dry. Oh, good thing we swapped out. Holy shit. Okay. Let's uh, let's throw a ball. Let's see what happens. What do we have? Moon ball, ultra ball. I guess we'll just do an ultra ball. Yep. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Man. Mr. Mime is getting all kinds of good attention here. I like that. Yo, I used a Mr. Mime in Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I don't know if any of you guys saw that one. That Let's Play. But we used a Mr. Mime. It was actually one of the stars of the team, really. <laughs> so here we go. We got ourselves a Mr. Mime. Galarian Mr. Mime. Never would have thought. Its talent is tap dancing. It can also manipulate temperatures to create a floor of ice. Well, what's interesting is, um, no. We, uh... We saw a regular Mr. Mime before. It's a friggin' Obama Snow. God damn. I guess I'll fight it. I guess I'll fight it. It's a level 55. Holy shit. Same strategy. Swap out and go into crisis. Oh boy. Yeah, we saw a regular Mr. Mime in, um... When we did the, uh... The gym challenge for the dark gym. There were just Mr. Mimes hanging around. And they weren't Galarian Mr. Mimes. They were just regular old Mr. Mimes. So I don't know what the deal was with that. I'm assuming we can't find normal Mr. Mime here. Alright, give me that EXP. Get some level ups out of that. Hilda's the only one who's not at 50 yet. Brave Bird, oh boy! Um, do we want to use Brave Bird? 
I mean, we get so much recoil damage. Do we want Brave Bird? Or do we want to stick with the safe drill pack? I feel like drill pack's the way to go, honestly. I feel like drill pack's the safer play here because um, I don't want to be taking the kind of recoil damage that, re that Brave Bird's going to be throwing at me. All right, let we need to we need to level up Hilda. I think what I'll do between episodes. Between episodes, I will grind up some more raids. I think between episodes, I'll do some raids. And try to get candies. Um, I don't know what... Oh, God. This is not a matchup I like. Actually, I think it should be okay. Should be okay. Dark type moves are neutral. It's got something that's super effective, though. Don't know what it is. Does he have a steel coverage move? Metal Claw. Oh, he does. Ow! There we go. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure how much, like, if we're... We're probably on par. I don't know that we need to level up, but I, I'd like to get Hilda... Is that Claydol? Yeah, we'll switch. Um, it's an Aurora. Alright, Buggo. Alright, Buggo. Ice beam this bitch. There we go. Look at that. Fantastic. Should I be called a battle man? No, I don't think so. There's another Mr. Mime. There's a bunch of Mr. Mime over there. Oh man, they're all over the place. Let's battle you. Corviknight ever disappears, Galar is doomed. I have not heard that legend, Cabby Joffrey. Corviknight. Well... This is not something Hilda wants anything to do with. Yeah. Yeah, pretty sure. Pretty sure we don't want anything to do with this. So we're gonna do a hard swap. Gonna do a hard swap into, I guess, Crisis. Crisis doesn't really want to take a steel lane either. Yeah, I guess Crisis. Neutral. Yeah, that's fine. That was a cr okay, that was a crit. You look good. I don't know how much Corviknight weighs. I feel like it weighs a lot. Heat Crash might not do the damage I need it to. Stealing me again, bitch. Fuck you. Why are you hitting all your steel wings? Ugh. Alright, we're gonna have to heal up this turn. Seems kind of dumb, but we have, like, no health left. So we definitely need to heal up. I'm gonna Hyper Potion. Alright, Crisis. There we go. I feel much safer now. Alright, so we can go with something... We can go with, like, Ancient Power. So I don't waste the... Heat Crash PP. Nice, we finally got a miss. Finally. There we go, get out of here, Corviknight. Get out of here. Bunch of level ups there. Crisis, Snapdragon, and uh, who else? Hilda! Good on you, Hilda. Oh, that wasn't even his only mon. Alright. Flygon. Alright, that's... Uh, this, this is fucking Aurora food. Pretty sure you do not want to take an Ice Beam. But you're gonna. You're gonna take an Ice Beam. And you're not gonna like it. Here we 
go. What's a fly gun? What's a fly gun? All right, 11,000. Nicely done. Do we need any heals? I think we do. I feel like we need some heals. Yeah, Hilda, Hilda can, can use a spray. And uh, you can use a spray. And you can use a spray. All good. All good. Everybody's good now. We got a cop over there. Fuck the police. Got more Mr. Mimes. A lot of Mr. Mimes. So many Mr. Mimes. That's pretty wild. We got a big old bear. We got a Sneasel. We got a camp. Alright. Holy shit! Okay. <laughs> um, I feel like this is actually onward. So hold up. What was back over here? Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Alright, Hilda. Can you run? Very good. Alright. So we're going this way. What was... We got this copper. This is just a dead end. Alright, so let's fight this copper. Oh, it's not a copper. It's a uh, post postal worker. Postman Hopper. And he's got a Pelipper. I feel like Hilda should be able to learn Thunderbolt. But I would need the TR for that. And I don't have that. That's unfortunate. So I'm going to just go ahead and Psychic you. Tailwind. Everybody's breeding VGC Pelippers over here. Eat this psychic. Nice. Nicely done. Nicely done. And we got a Noctowl. We'll stay in on that. Look at that beautiful Pokemon. Look at it. Look how beautiful Noctowl is. I love Noctowl so much. Don't hypnotize me. That's... Ugh. Ugh. All right, Hilda. I don't think Noctowl gets dream. Oh, look at you. Look at you, Hilda. Being the best. Right. Air slash Noctowl. Now, he's pretty tanky, so this might not kill. Yeah. I, re I remember Noctowl. I used Noctowl in um, Soul Silver. And um, he's way better in Soul Silver than he was in Silver, let me tell you that. <laughs> But, uh, Noctowl, I remember Noctowl being kind of specially bulky. He was quite fantastic against Morty. Stop doing that. Please stop doing that. Don't make me go get my rocks. You're just begging for a crit, man. There's a special D drop. Now what are you gonna do? Now what are you gonna do? That was beautiful before the hail started. Gonna roost again, but you got the special D drop. Ugh, <sighs> god damn. Uh, uh, depending on how, how much of this does. Takes it out, okay. There's a crit. That's, you, you wanna heal spam, you're begging for a crit. That's how it goes. You can keep heal spamming, but one of these days I'm gonna crit you. So we can go on this way. Continue on this way. Got that big old bear chasing me down. Let me battle you and then maybe I'll do the camp. I don't really want to battle them. Why are you standing there flinging your Pokeballs around? Hiker Donald. Getting in over your head with things. I know you get Heavy Slam. 
I'm not about that life. But, I do have Magical Leaf. And we have the glasses. We have the, um, not the choice specs, but the, the other glasses. The whatever specs. Not quite half, though. Stealth Rock. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, we're not switching now. Not switching now. We are going to just go ahead and power on with this Magical Leaf. Crit. Iron Defense. Okay, well, you're not doing anything that's scary, so that's fine. All I'm doing is taking Sandstorm Chip Damage. Alright. Uh, yep, yeah, just Magical Leaf. There we go. And Gigalith drops. These level ups. Alright, now what are you gonna send in? Stealth Rock's still up. Rhydon? We, we can hit you with Magical Leaf. Rhydon has really bad special defense. And this is quad effective, so this will probably be really good. This might even Oko. Yeah, it does. I used a Rhydon on that same team with the Mr. Mime. I know the special defense limitations of Rhydon, let me tell you. Alright, get out of here, Donald. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and camp. I'm gonna camp. Let's camp. Hey there, Hilda. Hey there, Hilda. Hey. Hey, you. Look at that rapid ash back there. Oh my god. Let's chat. Looks like he wants to play a lot. Tell me more. Wants to be with you forever. Oh. <laughs> Curious about Tristan. He wants a lot of attention. I bet you do. Likes you a lot. Oh, that's amazing. Curious about Tristan. Tell me more. So he wants to play. Let's go play. Okay. Let's play. Uh, here, get this ball. Get the ball. Get the ball, Hilda. This this has to be very demeaning. <laughs> this has to be so demeaning. Um, we got the, we got the, the ball, though. Alright, well, fine. Okay. Let's cook. I would like to start cooking. Let's start cooking. Let's, we've got a lot of good berries here. We've got, a uh, Qualot Berry. Use both of those, and a Ganlon Berry, and a Greppa Berry. We're, we don't care about getting rid of EVs right now. Two Roselli Berries, and a Lechi Berry, and a tomato, two Tomato Berries. I like that. Let's finish it off with an Apricot Berry. Let's do it. Oh, you're wasting those Lepas, man. Those Lepas are the best kind of berries to keep for yourself. What the fuck am I looking at on the right side, by the way? I see some dude tap dancing. Is that a Pokemon or is that some dude creeping up on our camp? What the fuck is that? Come on, roaring fire, roaring fire. They're all dancing and happy. Everybody's dancing and happy. Everybody's happy, everybody's free. Everyone will come around. Good, we got a lot of sparks. A lot of good sparks. This seems like a really good curry. I'm hoping this is a good curry. How we doing? Did we do a good? What the fuck is that guy? Sweet bone curry, oh shit. That looks delicious. Oh, man! Nom 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 nom. Hilda's happy. We got a Kaparaja class. Okay. What the fuck are you? What are you? It's so weird. 
He's so weird. What is it? It's gotta be related to Mr. Mime, right? Is wait a minute, is that a Mr. Mime evolution? Maybe. I don't know. Gentleman Glenn. Glenn. Glenn, Glenn. Oh my god. <laughs> it's Galarian Darmanitan. Okay, you are a Yukon Cornelius. Or the Yeti. You're the Yeti. You're actually the Yeti is what you are. Alright. So you're an ice type. I guess we're gonna have Crisis come in here. I'm afraid of that thing. Darmanitan's powerful. What are you gonna do? Taunt? That's fine. That's not scary. That's not scary. We're gonna heat crash you. Actually, I'm gonna just ro gonna rock slide. Why are you taunting me again? The oh, fuck off. Ah, <sighs> okay. Why are you taunting? What? What the fuck, dude? <laughs> What? Why are you clicking taunt three times in a row? It's like, yeah, I'm taunted. Alright, Phalanx. Okay, yeah, we want to switch. We can switch back into Hilda. Oh no, you get first impression. I think I should be fine. That should be fine. Look at this guy. What the fuck is this guy? What even are you? I'm tanky. I can take that. Yeah, there we go. Get out of here, Phalanx. I mean, I guess he's really no different than, like, Doug Trio or Execute or something, right? Just a bunch of things together as one Pokemon. Rap locked. We're staying in on that. Yes, this thing's. I immediately have regrets because I have a feeling you're gonna have poison jab. You are going to have poison jab. I'm faster. How am I faster? That's nuts. I cannot believe I'm faster than Grap Locked. Hatterene is slow as shit. Glenn, 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 Glenn. Glenn, Glenn, Glenn. Glenn, Glenn, Glenn. We got double. We got doubles. Xanax. Xanax and Hilda. Let's do it. It's been a while. I'm glad we can meet up again. Oh, yeah, these are the guys from before. We've fought them before. Interviewers Gillian and Cam. That's right, Cam, the guy with the camera, because that's just... Oh, this is bad for me. This is so bad for me. This this could not be a worse matchup for me. <laughs> this is literally the worst possible matchup for me. Oh my god. Alright, well, we gotta do a double switch immediately. Crisis, get in here. And I think... Um... I think Snapdragon. So we're probably gonna take a big chunk of damage here from these guys. Thunder, and he hits it. Hopefully that's gonna be on Snapdragon. We're gonna tank the shit out of it though. Don't paralyze me. Of course. Ugh, oh, shift, oh god. Oh god, that's scary. That's scary. Alright, well. Good thing is, Crisis should be able to smack up this Kling Clang. And if we can get a move in, 
Oh, don't. Really? You're gonna zap cannon me. Really? Really? That's the guaranteed para. Ugh. Stop thundering. Stop doing that. How are you hitting all these moves that have bad accuracy all the time? How are you doing that? Alright, Helios. Get up out of here. Xanax leveling up. Rain dance? Nah. Nah, we don't need that. Thankfully, we break through the para. Whew. That could have gone a lot worse. That could have gone so much worse. Kill the levels up. Oh, that's not the end. They got more mons. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. They got more mons. They got a Noivern. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck me. And a Toga Demaru. Okay. Welp. We're gonna try a Rock Slide. And... We've got nothing for this Toga Demaru. So I'm gonna Dragon Pulse the Noivern. How are you all hitting these horrible accuracy moves? Alright, we live it. Got the burn. That's great. Hit this rock slide. Oh, God. Okay. <sighs> oh, God. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Send in... I'm gonna use a full restore on Crisis. And Aurora, you're, we're gonna try ice beaming this Noivern. Is there a thing that they just hit all these hard to hit moves? Go and Dragon Pulse, okay. That's fine, we can eat that. We can eat that. That's no big, that's no big. We can take the Zing Zap. It's a crit, it's fine. We got the Ice Beam, the Noivern's gonna drop immediately. Now we just have to deal with this friggin'. Oh, yes, please. I guess we can get rid of Icy Wind. It's going to be hard to set up with this thing, because it does have a lot of weaknesses. Quad weak to rock, quad weak to fire, you know, all that stuff, but... If there's an opportunity to set up a QD, goddamn. Alright. I think we're just going to have to dig. We're going to have to dig. And, um, I think we're going to U-turn. Get some damage off, has some good damage. Got the iron barbs, it's fine. And we'll send out I guess Quoth can can clean up. So you're gonna dig. That's fine. I can use Reversal. Never expected to be clicking Reversal. Or not Reversal, Revenge. He goes first, I go second. We're gonna do this. Nah, he's gonna use Dig, we're good. That's it. That's it. Don't even need to use Revenge. All right, get out of here, Toga Tomorrow. Very good. Very good. Pay up. 18 Gs. All right, our team is a little worse for wear. 
But we made it to the city. That's so cool. That's so cool. This is awesome. Interesting to note, there was no victory road. Here we are. I think, though, before we head in, I'm going to go ahead and end off the episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. And make sure you're subscribed for more Pokemon Sword and Shield. Next time, we're going into Winden. I don't know what's going to happen, but I think uh, we might be starting the Pokemon League. So I hope you're excited for that. I know I am. I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.